Hello everyone, this is Cowboy2011 bringing you Grand Theft Auto 5 again. Lamar down. Franklin. I never get visitors. How nice. Oh, hey. Hey. What you doing here? I mean, I'm real glad you're here. Come here. I Come can't on. stay. Good. What's up, babe? Well, it's Lamar. What that fool want name? It's your best friend. He's your best fucking friend. For real. My best friend. My homeboy, right? My nigga. Man, fuck you. I mean, not like that, man. But no, he ain't. He just another nigga from the hood. Him, yeah. stretching all the motherfucking clowns. All he want to do is drag a motherfucker down and live in the past. And this is the future? A big empty house with nobody who gives a fuck about you. Well, shit, it works for me. It can work for you, babe. I'm getting married, Franklin, to adopt, and I'm murderer. Man, what the fuck you doing here, Tanisha? I'm worried about Lamar. You got to help him, Franklin. Man, that shit is old. Oh, I'm a legitimate businessman now, sister. I'm a CEO, an investor. I'm a Illuminati. I'm a fucking moron, nigga. You a phony fuck. What? I ain't saying you gotta marry the fool. I'm saying he's about to get killed over that deal you ain't put on with Stretch and set him up. Fuck, man. My whole fucking life I've been looking after this motherfucker and paying a price after him. Fuck. <laughs> well, at least do it one more time, Franklin, for me. For you? For you and your doctor? I love you and Lamar. We grew up together, but this life ain't for me, and you knew that. You ain't changing. I don't care how many cars you own, how many apartments you own, I don't care how many diamonds you put in your ear. It ain't for me, not done bad or done good. Hey, look, I'll change. No, you won't, and that's fair enough, but at least respect what you do, who you are. If you let that idiot die, you a bigger asshole than I thought. <laughs> Look, he's going up to some sawmill near Polito Bay. Uh, you do what you got to do. Ah. God dang it. Mm. I can't ride with her, no? Yeah. Franklin, what's up? Hey, man. I'm in a bit of a bad situation. My boy Lamar got set up. I think he up near Bonito Bay at some sawmill with some balls. Could you like do some computer magic and look into it? Is that possible at all? It uh, should be. I've got a back door into the Polito Bay police network left over from the score we did up there. Uh, give me a second here. Uh, hold on. Uh, uh, yes. So what it say? Uh, uh, this must be it. Uh, there are older reports of a weed operation being run by an African-American gang. Uh, the files got buried, so uh, I'm guessing they paid off the cops. Oh. They grow weed up there? Growing it in the hills, most likely, but they might be packing and shipping it out of this sawmill. I expect a fair few of them up there. Shit. And I'm gonna need some help. Can you tell Mike and Trevor to meet me up there? They still aren't getting along that well. Tell them it's for me, and it's serious. Thanks, man. <laughs> Studios, Radio Los Santos. We've been doing this. I don't care about Radio Los Santos. I three and a half miles almost. Oh god. Oh gosh, dang it. Lamar. 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 I don't know if I needed this for this trip or not. Look pretty sharp at the red eyes. Going okay. Oh, I don't need that. Nope, didn't need it. Okay, need it now. Need it again. Okay. Okay. Need it again. God dang it. Get on the ground. Don't act like you're going anywhere. Oh god, turn about five. Okay, there. Here. Okay, no way I wouldn't make that turn. Yeah, 
Yes, this car was made for off-road. Can't you tell? Okay. Yep. Just like some off-road. Screw the freeway. We can go over the mountain. Through the mountain, rather. I don't need my lights on. I don't need headlights. Just distractions. Real world! Oh god! Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Yes! All part of the plan. See how much time I saved? I've had to stop and go. Stop some more and go. I don't think I should do it again. Because it doesn't look like my car can take much more. Stop, stop, stop. There we go. They beat yeah. me here. Why'd you invite this schoolie, huh? We want Lamar to be rescued, not sold to the bad. Give it a rest, asswipe. <laughs> man, we'll talk to him, shut the fuck up. Now let's take a look at this place, man. Lester said this was some type of big weed store spot. Huh. The place is crawling with ballers, you know? Now me and you, we don't mind the old dang warfare, but sway box over there. <laughs> He'll turn her, I said, bite me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god. Yeah, I see you weed, but where the fuck is the mall? Oh shit, there we go. Oh yeah, my god. Tell Trevor I'm gonna be up on this hill with my rifle. I don't wanna be anywhere around him when he fucks this whole thing up. Classic, classic, huh? He's already <laughs> planning his escape. Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh god. He runs away from the fight, I run towards it. Go to any Martins. Okay. I saw a few possible entry points when I got here. One, the front entrance on the right there. It's the most direct way in and most likely the heaviest. Two, down the hill to my left. There's a bulldozer there. Might be able to use it in the assault. Three, in the other side from me, by the railroad. Should be possible to avoid the worst of it that way, but I won't be able to cover you. All right, thanks. Don't shoot and don't get too close. Trevor goes uh, okay. run in. You're the expert in springing attacks on the unsuspecting. Okay. Here's where I'm making my play. I'm going right at him. All right, my turn to move. All right, I'm at the spot. When the time comes, I'll do what I can from up here. We might stand a better chance if we come at him from two angles. Maybe. I'm going, okay, God. Said he could use that dozer. Franklin needs a dozer because he can't dish out. Uh, oh god. He can't dish out on Trevor's death engine. Okay, dozer. Check it. Frank, we'll attack on your signal. Let's go find the dude. I'll take it wherever I can. Okay, I didn't need a change. There we go. Lamar! Lamar! See, hey! You see Lamar again? I know, I know, sorry, Alan. Just guys wearing clothes. You got a friend of ours! <laughs> I 
Oh, you like Frank? It? You found Lamar yet? No, don't. Just more bottles. Come on. Where's he at? Oh, God. Make sure you wasn't quiet. 
I'm going to make sure I ain't clapping. Clearly, you can't. Next time, homie, don't come. And hey, matter of fact, if you do come, don't bring him, dude. Man, look, let's not talk next time. Next time, don't get your ass in the situation, all right? It's the hood, Frank. That's what happens in the hood. You know the fucking don't. Not for everyone. Uh, I'm one of them dudes that it happens to. I don't want to do that. Man, you gonna tell me what was going on back here? Hood shit, homie. That's the shit that's different from the country club shit your overpaid ass is presently accustomed to. Man, wow. stress put us on this shit, man. Man, we gonna get on his ass. Man, fuck that, homie. Look like I give a shit. Nigga, I give a shit. Stress do what he do. Niggas want me dead, be dead himself. I ain't gonna overreact to shit. Overreact? Man, that nigga stress tried to get you killed, nigga. Nigga, that's the hood. I'm still here, ain't I? Just. You sure Stress knew they was gonna book me? Yeah, nigga Stress knew. Everybody knew Stress knew. Tanisha knew Stress knew, and she don't even come around the fucking hood no more. <laughs> Damn, man, nigga Stress janky like that? Man, you don't see this? Miss Stress been screwing us from the start. Like from back in the day? From like the other day, dawg. Since after we went to the recycling place and D and them balls tried to take us down. But Stretch put in the work on D. Yeah, man, that's survival. Remember how angry his ass got? Especially with you bringing him into this shit? Alright, alright, but tell me this though. If Stretch was fucking with your boy LD, why he set us up with the deal for the break in the first place? He'd go off and make peace with the ballers, come back, and he'd put us on a lick on Grove Street. Man, you remember Grove Street? That brick was drywall. Ripping us off was probably Stretch's ideal anyway. Damn, you think so? It makes sense, don't it? Man, I ain't even know it, man, maybe. Man, Stretch got in with the ballers when he was inside. Played us as marks, dog, but a bunch of them got booked. So now they gotta come back out. So stress says you out there what they doing the Kush deal. Hmm. Then you show up and save the day. Yeah, thankfully. Man, it wouldn't even be the same if your boy LD wasn't out here getting in the shit. And LC wasn't getting him out of it. You know what I'm talking about? Man, I don't know. Nope, wasn't gonna make it. That shit was fun, nigga. Don't tell me you didn't enjoy scrapping like we did back in the day. It ain't back in the day no more, dog. But it <laughs> felt like it was. Okay, fool. It was fun saving your useless ass one more fucking time. There you go. That wasn't too hard. You should have seen your face when I came in. You was like, shit, shit, shit. Hey, shit, man. Oh, bullshit, nigga. <laughs> you better check them drawers, homie. You probably shit yourself. <laughs> Fuck you, man. I don't care if I die. It's a compliment if they send an army out there, nigga. They only send like two of the little homies to get you. Nigga, you didn't look like they was paying you no compliment, nigga. Uh, Must have just caught a glimpse of your ugly ass. Nigga, you think I'm some angel come to take your ass somewhere you never going to. You pray to your white man God, homie. Spot. I'm going to the great plain beyond where the buffalo keep on roaming and the little squall bitches want me to nut on their wow. face all day. Get out of my truck. Sorry. 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 So I guess, I guess what we learned is, nigga, don't think it ain't no fun if you have fucking with the homies, nigga. You feel me, my nigga? <laughs> I guess you can look at it like that. Hey, but on some real shit, my nigga, um, you know you nigga out here doing BAD, man. Why don't you slide me a few dollars or something, you know what I'm talking about? It's hard out here. Oh, shit, my nigga, that's nothing. Shit, nigga, know you done went all Illuminati and shit, you know what I'm saying, leaving the street niggas in the back. But damn, man, uh, way to keep a nigga down, my nigga, I mean... Thank you. I guess it's a payment for all the work a nigga put in for you getting the cars and shit, you know what I'm talking about? Give a nigga just enough money to get him a little 40 ounce in the bucket of chicken on the way to the poor house, huh? Man, don't be like that, dawg. Because number one, I never got paid for them motherfucking cars. Number two, I saved your motherfucking ass. No matter how many times you and that tiny motherfucking brain of yours are trying to get us killed, I saved you, dawg. What are you supposed to, my nigga? I thought we was homies for life. Me too, but I thought we was trying to get out of this bullshit. You live in a fantasy, homie. The best uh -huh. thing you can hope for is a big turnout for your motherfucking funeral. Nigga, ain't nobody coming to your funeral. What? Man, what about all the motherfucking times I saved your life, homie? What about that? Oh, thank you, homie. Thanks for leaving me a nigga in the backfield. Oh. You know what, my nigga? If your ass can just act civilized, you will get some work. But instead, you want to be this gang-banging, mad dog and asshole. Oh, my bad, Mr. Gold Card. Excuse me, sir. Thanks for helping out a post street nigga like me, sir. You can go now, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nigga, who you think I am, nigga? Fuck you, Lamar. Nah, fuck you, F, nigga. I thought we was homies, nigga. But that's some shit that just got past you, my nigga. You know what, dog? 
If something good comes up, I hit my dude, man. Chill out, all right? Yeah, whatever, nigga. You just hit me when you find out what the true concept of friendship is, nigga. We came from the sandbox together. I know that. I got you, dog. If something good come up, I got you. Yeah, whatever, nigga. I'm in the turf, nigga, if you remember where that is. Oh. Oh! Wow. What's up, player? Hello, Frank. Wow. And I don't know y'all. We done, Hey, man. we ain't done yet, bone man. Not yet. Nearly. Now, what the fuck y'all want me to do? Kill the president? Fuck his wife or something? Or invade some fucking country? No, no, something more sensible. Something that's gotta be done. Hey, when the timing's right, you're gonna take old Trevor and put him out the pasture. Oh, me? Michael will be sensible, but Trevor... Trevor won't be. Trevor is a liability that none of us can afford. Oh. Man, Trevor saved you. He saved both y'all asses. And it's unfortunate. Hey, when we give you the word, you're gonna do this thing. Didn't you get shot? Man, get Michael to do it. Me and Trevor cool, dog. Michael can't do it. Trevor won't let him near. That's why it's up to you, homie. Oh. Hey, who is that? Nobody. Don't worry about it, nigga. Hey. Lost an ass, nigga. <laughs> God dang it. I gotta kill Trevor. Not doing it. I lost 50 bucks. I gave him 50 bucks. Oh. Accuracy, 52% mission time, three-way headshots. I got nothing. Wow, I didn't think I would. Oh, well, this is Cowboy 21 signing off. My PS is Cowboy 11. If you like playing with me, peace out. Yeah. I, oh. Abducts. My dad's not a complete a-hole. I'm going to the premiere of this movie, Church Bro. Got to meet him at. the so he can get a tux the next time. Stop swag. Oh my god. Hashtag swag. Anyway. Cowboy 2011. Mm, online transition update. Uh, I don't. You're down. I'll look at that later. Anyway. See you later. Peace out.